call me the myth buster. Six weeks. Six weeks. Six weeks. Your locks need to be done in six weeks or it's going to break off. Eight weeks. Eight weeks. You can't have growth longer than eight weeks or your locks will break off. Call me the myth buster. Leave your hair and find out whether these myths are true. I have worked with locks that are three months, 12 weeks, which means a person only needs to sit in the chair four times a year with small size locks. And people do not have to in come in the chair and sit in the chair as often. The myth buster today is... You need to get your hair done in six weeks. You need to get your hair done in six weeks. You need to get your hair done before eight weeks. You need to get your hair done before eight weeks. Call me the myth box. <laughs> Call me the myth buster mate. <laughs> People have sat in the chair 12 weeks down the line with smaller size locks than the traditional sister lock size and their hair hasn't fallen out. Their locks are still attached to the growth. 12 weeks, 10 weeks, 4 months, 5 months after their last re- tightening or re-locking or re-knotting session. Pay attention. Small locks wearers. Pay attention. You are the expert in your hair. You always remain the expert in your People hair. People go three months, five months, six months and their small size locks hasn't fallen out. You work it out. Is this true? Six, six weeks. weeks. Six weeks. Six weeks. And if you don't get your hair done, your hair falls out. Now, if your hair falls out, find out why. Do not make the assumption that it's because you've not had your hair redone or relocked or retightened. It might just be the hand. Because if the hand wants to prove a point that you're weakening your locks as a result of stretching out your retightening appointment, the hand can prove it. So if your locks are falling out because you've waited beyond the six weeks, why is that? It can't be just because your hair is growing. There has to be another reason. Think. You must begin to understand what is going on with your growth, with your locks, with your African hair texture. You have the power to be empowered and to dictate how you want to carry on with your small size locks, how you want it cared for. This is Melissa Blade. Today I am your Mythbuster.